Right now, it's the influx and the availability of, of rifles into these hostile environments. As low as just a bump, all the way up to gunshot wounds. I mean, all those things can occur. Loading into the back of a troop carrier, I fell straight backwards. My body basically inverted, and I landed with all that weight on the top of my head. Were it not for that helmet, it probably would have been a lot worse. We have many, many, many different variables creating little tiny stresses on us as operators, and those stresses tend to compound. Every single little thing that we can do to, to lower those little stresses, and if we can take everything we can and make it slightly more comfortable, we can make it slightly lighter, we can make it one less thing that we have to worry about, at the end of the day, it makes us more efficient. To be fatigued is to, is to lose situational awareness, is to lose operational effectiveness. And a lot of these operations can take place over the course of 32 hours. They begin worrying about personal comfort, which is a very natural human reaction, when they should be worried about what the mission objective is. You've got guys that are operating for 30-something hours at a time, and they're having to wear that helmet the whole time. To be able to do that and not have a headache is pretty amazing. And so what happens is, particularly with these 3M products, is they're giving us a degree of longevity on these crisis sites that we just didn't have previously. And so that's my primary concern as assistant team commander, is that putting my guys into equipment that really affords them the greatest possible protection, and now are afforded an incredibly lightweight helmet that prior, you know, even, even five years ago, was, was three times the weight. And there's been tremendous material advances. Uh, 3M, I think, is at the cutting edge of that. And there's some very light materials that are being utilized for protection. So the ultra lightweight helmets are not just extremely comfortable, but frankly, the best I've ever experienced. When it can make us more lethal in the Marine Corps uh, or the military, or it can make us uh, more effective at serving the warrant and being safer on the ground so that way these guys can go home at the end of the day, that that's an advantageous piece of the gear.